Hey, wonderfuls. Yeah, Nene Leaks is trending. Yes. The former Real Housewives of Atlanta star is kicking butt and taking names. Nene's ratings for the interview with uh, CK is higher than Real Housewives of Atlanta. So y'all know Nene could have had her own show. Okay? We all know that Real Housewives of Atlanta hasn't been the same since Nene left. Yes. And she is exposing the mess at Bravo. She is still in litigation with, with them, so she can't say much. But listen, we already know because anytime the star of the show is put out like that and not heard on important issues, we know something ain't right. Yes. Because listen, CK told her, you built the success of that show and made it a number one hit. And then to not be given consideration for the story or anything that's going on to bring to continue to bring the ratings up, I mean, that's just unheard of unless there's something else going on beneath the surface. Now, why wouldn't a person who was the cause of the ratings being as they are be given some sort of consideration about the direction in which the show was going? And we see it was valid because look at it now. The ratings continue to plummet. They're, they're vacillating between low, medium, low, low. And come on now. Yes. And she even took issue with the fakeness. Okay. The fakeness involving the storylines. And all these boyfriends popping up during the time. So what was wrong with that? Because we all see how the ratings just plummeted. And you know it's le legit. You know it's legit. Because look at what's happening with some of these other reality shows. Love and Marriage Huntsville. And the fake stories. With the Scots. And with all the nonsense. It's right before our very eyes. Now... We know she's speaking truth about the fakeness, okay? And so for all the other things that she can talk about, oh, she is talking about it. So check it out because I am telling you, this woman deserves a fair chance, okay? Regardless of her personal a lot of people know that what she did wasn't right concerning getting with that married man we know that but we are talking business here now and what started before that situation with this married man okay we're talking business now and we're talking about the history of the female lead being you know what and this happening to her okay let's get real about this of course there are some personal things that we look at nini and say you know nini you should have taken your own advice when you said close your legs to married men yeah we know all that but look we're talking business now we're talking about the future of what it means for a woman of Nini's disposition, and you all know what I'm saying, to be heard on matters that are important, especially to someone who was very involved with the show being number one. And you know me hating to agree with CK about anything. He's right concerning the fact that there would be no franchise like this if it wasn't for Nini Leakes. 
I mean, they joke about she built that on her back, on her fingernails, on her toe. They joke about it, but they're joking about truth. Everyone knew that Nene was the star of that show, okay? So put aside what you may personally feel about her now and look at the historical aspect of this. Look at the business aspect of this and for the woman, okay? Talk to you later, wonderfuls.